good. Is it good? Good afternoon. Yeah, it's good afternoon. It's two o'clock. I started my day earlier, but uh, still on a video right now at the gas station. So I finally put gas and took the truck out. I hope everybody's having fun. I'll be having brain fog. It's my bad, bro. Let me start back up. I hope everybody's enjoying the day. Keep positive, stay positive. Don't let any negative energy come by you. That's number one. And please like, share, subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. The subscriber count is going up and that's a lot of love for, for, for everybody that's watching the video and watching my channel. Like, subscribe to my channel. Go. Well, start my day a little late. Not a little late, I actually started early. I left my damn tripod in my shop. So I gotta hold the phone right now. People look at me weird because I'm talking to my phone. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I put the uh, rims on, as you can see. Truck is dirty. Put the stocks on for now. I gotta redo this caliper. Might as well do all them over, but for now, I'm going to do that caliper for now. Take the truck to get washed. Put all four stocks on. Uh, still deciding on what I'm going to do with the other rim. She's still pumping, man. What the hell? I had no gas at all. In the morning time, I had to come with the container, leave the truck last night in my shop because I, I would have never made it. Came this morning, put a five gallon tank, put some ethanol, took it, did the wheel swap, and now I'm here again. But uh, I'm taking right now, what I gotta do right now is go to the dealership pick up the oil the filter take it back to the shop do the oil change um, like I said with the rim situation I gotta see what I'm gonna do with that rim if they could fix it they can if they can't I'm gonna have to order it and I'm gonna have to get the same spec I can't just get any type of different specs different offset it has to be the same offset and same bolt pattern, which is five by one twenty-seven, and I think the I think the offset was thirty-five millimeter, but I really don't want to get the thirty-five millimeter. I want to get like a little uh, lower number so the rim can stick out a little bit because I was using a thin spacer for the front caliper, and I don't want to deal with that again. So I might buy two rim. Most likely, most likely I'm gonna buy two rim brand new with no holes in it, but it has to be like at least twenty-five or 25 or under millimeter for the for the offset because i'm not running those, those thin spaces again the little thin spaces i'm not doing that i'm not using those stupid little plastic looking freaking lug nuts i'm not doing that man this shit is scary i almost lost my life i'm not gonna do that again hell no and i don't recommend anybody to do that nope but um i'll be back uh Catch you in the next one. I'll be in the dealership. I'll be right back. Just got here to the Chrysler. Was this not even a Chrysler dealer? This is like um the warehouse for like Chrysler, Mopar, whatever. So like dealership have their warehouses where they stock. You know, every every I guess state has their own warehouses. I think this one distributes Connecticut and Jersey and a whole bunch of stuff like that. I mean, not stuff like that. A whole bunch of... This one distributes all the states. I think the tri-state. And this is located in... And, uh... What is this? White Place, Westchester County, I could say. So, you can't really come here to buy it. Because... You have to know somebody in the inside of the dealership to get the parts. So I got my boy that works in 
Centravo, Chrysler. Not say names, but he's the one that sends me here to get my parts. Like when I got my transfer case or my the rear differential, I got them here. I didn't have to wait. See how they load up? They load all the parts up. The regular Chrysler vans. The delivery vans, excuse me, the delivery vans. And, um, yeah. Good to have connects like this. That's why I get, like, good discount. For my mobile family. If you need discount, discount, hit me up. I got you. Grab my things for this. See, they don't even got no sign or nothing here. It's like real the street. <laughs> I'll be right back. Let me go call this dude up. Tell him outside. BRB. This is crazy here. Look at this. Mopar Heaven. This is crazy out here. This whole stuff. You can't, anybody, nobody can just come, come in here and just see this whole stuff. Pick up my oil and my filters. Um, I'm gonna tell you something about these filters. Let me just put those in the car. I'll be right back. This shit is crazy right here. I'll be right back. Let me put this in the car. Pop up to the train. I mean, pop up to the tire shop. Hold on. Hold on. Train is passing by. Hold on. Hold on. City problems. Another one. Oh my god. Sort of nice. But um came to the tire shop. Check the rim out. Tire out, swap that tire. I'm gonna let you guys see how bad is that tire once you takes it out. Uh, the rim situation I'm gonna buy two rims because I want I don't want to run no spacer, not no five millimeter spacer. I'm not doing that no more, like I said before. Hold on again with the damn freaking train. Nice. I had one of the 4GCR before. I'm gonna do like a little compilation thing uh, with the pictures from the TLs and what cars that I had before. Put it on YouTube and you guys let me know how that comes. 
do a little small little video of what cars that I had. It's gonna be like pictures in it though. I really barely got videos. Back then, videos wasn't the shit. It was pictures. I mean it was, but I wasn't into it, but you already know. Um Yeah, I'm gonna buy two I didn't even see the TLX. I'm gonna shoot this TLX just now. Back then, um I mean I'm gonna buy two wheels. Uh not gonna run the spaces no more. The little small spaces. Hold on, let me show you the tire real quick. Hold on. This one, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, see? I almost died. No bueno. That shit, high speed pop, right? This is nice right here. I like this. It's on bags. Look at my caliper, bro. I gotta fix this. So what I was thinking for temporary, I'm gonna go back to the subject again. Let me just explain what I'm gonna do with this. I'm, uh, I'm not gonna send the caliper out right now at the moment because I might change the colors on them. I might not. The reason is I might keep the color because that's what bring the track off. People know the track off because they're the caliper. But I'm. Um, Maybe change the caliper color, but not red. Definitely not red. Maybe white. Something different to pop it out. I don't know. Man. Still got the factory struts on this. Um, the rear is different. So yeah, we're well, back to the subject. The second subject. The first subject. We'll go back again about the rim. Excuse me, I might be all off today. So I'm gonna temporary. I'm just gonna sand it down, tape this part up right here, and tape up whatever I gotta tape up. Sand it down nicely and shoot it. Shoot the same, try to get the same color close to shoot it for now. That way it doesn't look bad, you know. I'm gonna probably do that tomorrow. Um, and my, my, my tail lamp, I'm gonna do it tomorrow also, too. So I'm gonna have the truck in there, I'm gonna work on the truck tomorrow. And the oil change. And the oil change, I forgot. Keep on forgetting, man. Sorry. It's nice here. I like this. Well, mine's is an A-spec. I got the same one in blue. I think this is like a 15 to 7, 15 to 16. That's what they made the body style. 17, I believe they changed the nose. Nice though, I like it. I like it. Uh, damn, about I don't know. Think about slamming my my hoopty, my daily. What you guys think? It's nice though. And I was gonna put my. If I do that to my TLX, I'm gonna customize this front lip on it, on the A spec bumper. It's been done. I did it before. Uh not that hard but it just takes time and i'm gonna add a lip on the rear so he, this guy changed the bumper this his bumper is like an 18 18 and up it's not this is not a regular 14 15 i mean not a regular 15 16 bumper this is the uh, uh 18 um uh, tech package bumper 18 tech package bumper because i got the chrome and the lip is different got the little uh, diffusers in it. It's different. But, um, yeah, he changed the bumper. He didn't do the A-spec, though. A lot of people with these cars, they put the A-spec bumper on. But the lip that I'm going to use for my A-spec bumper, I really know what lip to use. I got to cut it, trim it a little bit, make it shorter. Cut it. Sh I'm going to make a process video for that. If I hook up the TLX right now, Maybe I hook up the TLX. I'm still 
waiting for my um my MDX to get released. I don't know what's going on, but if I make if I hook up the TLX, I'm gonna put bags on it. Um, do that the lip front lip and do the rear lip so I can be different than other people. I'm gonna show you the rims real quick that you got for show right here. Yeah, I, I had to run out. Copyright reasons, I had to run out. But those are the rims that he's selling. It's three piece wheels made by Airtech. Um, the price is giving me to it, it's not bad at all. So three piece, uh, it doesn't look like ECLs because it has a lip on it. I don't know, I gotta look at them. And the price I'm getting it for, it's off the hook. So if I do buy those wheels from him, most likely, I'm gonna hook up my TLS. I'm gonna put the bags on it, I'm gonna put the front back lip on it and make it, you know, it's gonna be my daily, but another bag daily. It is what it is, you know, let's see what happens. Uh, again, train. Can't really talk out here. Damn rain. Uh, I mean, damn. I said rain. <laughs> Train. Yo, bro, I'll be fucking up with this. Talking this shit. Talking like I'm. That I wasn't born here. I want to talk about the rims. About the track up rims. Back to the subject one about my track ball, uh, the wheels that I have, 22. I'm gonna change them. Uh, I'm not gonna fix it. But when I got the hole on it, the puncture on hole, I'm gonna buy two wheels. The reason why I'm gonna buy two wheels, and this is why I go back to the subject, is what I'm telling you. I'm not dealing with the, again, I might be repeating myself. I'm not dealing with the spaces, the little small spaces, I'm not dealing with that no more. Um, no, I'm, that's a no-no. I'm not dealing with cheap lug nuts, no-no. So the rims that I had in the front, I guess, you know, um, the person I bought the rim from, it was used, but it was in good condition. And I don't know why, but I had to use two five millimeter spaces. So it was like one little, uh, the little five millimeter, so I used two of them so that I could descend. The origin of rims all around is th uh, 35 millimeter. So to clear my caliper, I need 25 millimeters. Rims, offset, 25 millimeter offset. So it pokes out a little bit on. So I'm not gonna just do one side. If I'm gonna do that right, correct offset, correct bolt pattern, and I like the wheels on my truck, it looks nice. And I'm keep that same style. I'm gonna buy I'm gonna buy two wheels. I'm not running the driver's spot the driver's side spaces, everything on even, I'm not doing none of that. I'm wanting it the right way. Um, he told me the price, he said, yo, I gotta get you a good price. Probably get it in one, two days. If she gets it in one, two days, my tires are still good, I'll just send the two out. 
or I might just send damn, my eyes, sorry. I might just send all four of them out again and we get it redone, refreshed again. You know, same color, I'm not gonna change the same color. And get, you know, the proper weight, proper fitment, proper everything proper. I don't like that put in spaces and all that big thick spaces, uh, adapters, I'm not doing that. I, I did that before. I'm not doing that again. Nope. Alright, bro. Let me go check on my tire and see what's going on. I'll be right back. I really don't know how the hell this should happen, but it's bad. So you see what I mean? I can't flip it inside out. And that's the outside right there. That's the inside. Usually people flip it, but you can't flip this. Look at the sidewall, it should look crazy. Crazy, man. Tires, come out of my man. Get it right there. Uh, Apollo tires. I think I shot them out before, but Apollo tires. That's his number right there. 929 507 9226. Uh, they call him Flow. He's a good man, man. They took care of you. Got brand new tires. Use tires, whatever you need. They help you out. He's not one of those snakes people, those snakes out here that try to get you, you know? He's an honest person and try to keep it right with you with the tires. Try to keep it reasonable with you with the tires. My bad. I'm hungry, I didn't eat on all day. Nah, I got stuck with that. They're from New York. I don't know if they sell this, like in Cali or wherever all the states. Do they sell these? These are banging. Just banging, banging. I really don't eat chips like that, junk food. But I eat junk food. Like sweets, but chips. I'm not crazy about chips, but this is one of my favorites. Yeah, I got my other favorites is the white popcorn, the smart food one. That's my other favorite. I don't really, know. I'm not crazy about chips, potato chips, any type of chips, poker chips. I don't know, maybe, <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm gonna go to the shop real quick, probably wipe down these factory wheels. There's no point in washing the car right now. Do a little wipe down on the rims, wipe down on the truck, and I'll see where I'll go next. 
most likely probably go home uh, go home ain't nothing else to do go home and uh excuse me go home get some food go home and just relax take a shower and relax until the next day I can't relax I gotta edit videos it's too late to go try to get the helmet uh, tomorrow I'm gonna try to get the helmet the racing helmet and do the oil change and uh, the caliper and uh, try to get the what else the tail light done praying that it doesn't rain I really don't because I'm excited to go to the track but if it happens to happen it rains it's, you know, it wasn't meant to, meant to be meant for me to go it wasn't meant for me to go you know, Sunday they have another event I might pop up to that other event but I really wanted to take this truck to the track I really did you know like I'm guess I'm gonna have to wait till Friday to see what's going on with to the weather to see what's going on with the weather because I'm not gonna touch taking out my seat and emptying the trunk for nothing you know it has to be you know the weather gotta be clear for me to start taking out the back seats and all that stuff um, helmet wise and all of the chain I mean chain all of the chain you be I be yo I gotta slap myself mad freaking hard one day Buying a helmet and changing my oil, it's a must. Oil change is a must. I have to do that, regardless. Buying a helmet, I don't need it right now, but there are gonna be future videos for me taking the truck to the track, so I'm gonna need a helmet. So regardless of what, I gotta buy a helmet. You know? I gotta buy the helmet. Rims, put it back on whenever the other two rims come. I'll find out tomorrow we, what's the ETA on it and I don't gotta leave no deposit I'm going with him what's the ETA on the rim hopefully I'll get it by next week once I get it next week I'll send it back out to get powder coated send all the four of them out so it won't be no mismatch colors and then slap it back on that's it at least I know you see that tire was bad that tire was real bad at least I know I got a decent tire on it right now. You know? I got like 90% thread life, uh, thread, you know, still alive. That one right there, the sidewall was bad, you know. If I would have done a, a peel out or burn out, whatever you want to call it, to burn the, to heat up the tires, it would have popped. It was bad. It would have popped. Uh, yeah, I'm talking too much. Shut up, Jay! My bad. <laughs> if you guys started the channel right now at the middle, in the middle of the of the video, please comment. Comment below if you think I'm stupid. <laughs> if you think I'm funny, comment below. Um, no. Comment, be uh, comment, not even comments. Yo, bro, I'm bugging now. <laughs> if you think I'm funny, comment below. I think I'm stupid. All right, it is what it is. Everybody got their own opinion, right? Um, but now, nah, if you start on the video right now, like mid, um, I want you to give a big thumbs up. I hope you're enjoying it so far. But give a big thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Subscribe now. It's free. Post a note. A post. Uh, press the note post notification that way you can see me uh putting content out you don't gotta wait and yeah share your share the video share it to your friends your family anybody that's around that likes car content share it even if it's not car content share it because i do have family days when i would take my son out and i do things with him you know like summertime is coming i'm gonna be going out everywhere i'm gonna go out to amusement park water parks i'm gonna be doing a lot of stuff family stuff with my son um yeah i'll be back on the next one not next one but i'll be back in the next clip you know what i mean y'all you know what i mean let me just shut up shut up jake
What's up guys, back at my shop. A couple hours later. Doing some stuff out here. Still feel nice also. Still feel nice. About to go uh, grab some food. And uh, go home. Grab some food, go home. Come back tomorrow, do the things I gotta do tomorrow with the truck. wiping my truck I'll show you guys right now I didn't spend them I didn't spend no money to go car wash bro it's not gonna work it. it's gonna rain a couple of days I hope not but that's what they're saying I hope it doesn't Compared to daytime, should be crazy out here. Traffic is ridiculous out here. I'm debating what to eat, man. I'm tired of eating the same food every day. I don't know what to eat. I don't want to drive far, I just want to go home. Tuesday. 
Tuesday at 12 35 City skyline, but uh, unfortunately, I, I, I didn't think about it. I did take a video, but it was for like Instagram. But I'm not gonna put it, maybe I'll put it, I don't know, maybe I'll put it in a clip somewhere in this video somewhere.
Street, this is 82 Street, my bad. 82nd Street. Got a new shop. Clearly, you see it's open. I don't know, I just, I just found this subject so freaking um, like interesting because I know I have viewers that not from New York City and they don't know, so I'm just showing them the viewers that's not from New York City. That when you do guys and when you when you guys do come down if you're hungry you go. What is this? Address fifteen eighty first avenue. You come down first avenue, you'll find a whole bunch of pizza shops, maybe restaurants that's open. reason I'm saying it because there is people that just eat pizza or like beef patties you know something that you want to grab late night you don't want you know sandwich from like the gas station you guys can drive down here and eat pizza <laughs> cheese pizza pepperoni pizza whatever pizza you guys prefer calzone Whatever you guys prefer. Because, you know, some people like me, I don't really like fast food like that. I'm not crazy about fast food. I like to eat food, food, you know. Pizzas, you know, it's not like food. Pizza is fast food. I don't know if pizza is fast food. Now, why am I talking about pizza? What the hell, bro? Let me stop driving, bro. Just shut up, Jake. Freaking dumb. Talk about the stupidest thing. <laughs> what is this? I don't know. I'm just trying to make content, bro. You know? Let me live. I'm like freaking a vampire. Be out here at nighttime. And I'm running low on fuel. Let me get out of there. Go back to my area. I got like what 45 minutes away. Go back to my house. I live in the suburbs, so I gotta drive. Right. get back to my area so I can end the video so another pizza shop pizza pizza yo bro oh, you see the you see the elevens that's I said elevens <laughs> yo bro I'm tired I'm something wrong with me the twelves is behind me Get off my phone for that. Pull my ass over. Smoke shop. Deli. I'm out. I'm right back. BRB. What's up, guys? Look at the time. Oh my god. I, I, I try to come home early and I can't. Um, I'm gonna keep it short and simple. You know, you already know what I'm gonna say. Please. Subscribe. What is that over around? Please like, share, and subscribe. If you're not subscribed, put the press the button. It's free. Post notification. That way you know that I'm posting a new video. Please. Guys, I love the support. I just need more so I can gain. And I could be more motivated to drop more videos, you know. I love everybody that's giving me all the love and support right now. Trust me, believe me. This is why, like, you know, I'm not giving up. But the more I get, the more motivated I am to pick up the camera and record. Daily content, this is what I'm trying to do. Um... Unfortunately, you know, like, 
Tomorrow's another day. Uh, I have a lot to do. Like today, I had a lot to. Tomorrow, I have a lot to do with the truck. Trying to get the oil change. What else? Oil change caliper. Tell like, and then I still gotta be in the shop because you know I have insurance. Just insurance adjusters coming to see a couple of cars, so I have to be there. You know, again. You guys know I own a body shop, and everything I do is on my by myself. I don't have no partners. It's solo. It's just me. So I do have employees, but the person I have, you know, he's still learning. That's that that's that's in the front desk. He's still learning. He's you know he knows, but he's still learning. He's still you know learning the tricks for talking to the adjuster giving the estimate you know but you know um you know, i'm trying my best i am really trying my best and you know i'm i'm kind of getting i'm hyper i'm not even kind of getting i'm already used to being with the camera in front of my face you know um not shy no more but don't mind me sometimes. It's just... Excuse me, guys. Don't mind me. Sometimes I'm just, you know... I have brain farts. <laughs> I gotta stop and talk. Especially in the nighttime when I'm on... Um, like, this time is 2 in the morning and I'm tired. And... To close the video out, this is what I gotta do. Um... Yeah, I already spoke what I'm going to do, so I'm going to close the video out right now. I'm going to go upstairs, eat my food, even though it's so late to eat right now, and it's not even good to eat at this time because I'm going to go to bed. Not even, I got to edit a video. And I got to wake up early in the morning. <laughs> Ain't that something. You see what I mean? Look, I work hard. I work hard. I try to give you content. I try to do all my daily life with the with the shop. I try to, you know, be there for my son, be there for my mom. It's a lot, you know. Please, guys, show me some more support. Share my channel with others. I'll be the best thing you can do for me. That's all I want is share my channel, share my video with others. Give it a big thumbs up. And... I'm good to go. You're going to see me drop in. Lots, a lot, a lot, lots, lots of bangers. Lots, lots of bangers. It's coming soon. Trust me, it's coming soon. I'm a little upset for the track for Saturday, but I'm praying that it doesn't rain and we're good to go. If it doesn't rain, that's a banger right there for the track day. Even though there's going to be more coming up, it just, I'm really excited, and I really want to, you know, do crazy GoPros and all that. I'm, I want, I'm getting this set up. So pray, let's pray. It doesn't rain Saturday, and we're good to go. Um, but yeah, I'm out. I'm gonna close the video out. I'm tired, and a lot in my mind. Tired a lot, not not bad way, but just a lot, too much, like all at once. But uh. I'm out of here. I'm going to close the video out. I'll talk to you tomorrow. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out.